a great graphic designer is hard to come by, and students in Oakland with a penchant for art, design, advertising, creativity, and communication were given a very professional opportunity recently by the Peralta Colleges in collaboration with the nonprofit organization ODALC. Oakland Digital is our organization. Inspire Oakland is what we're here to do. Inspire Oakland is our annual campaign that promotes uh, digital media careers to young people, uh, specifically at community colleges as well as some high schools for seniors. But the focus of it is how do we get young people to create great content that not only inspires Oakland, but also gets other people encouraged to come to Oakland and, and increase the uh, positive image here. Well, my name is David Flores and this is my design. Well, basically I got the whole point of the picture of the street signs in, that, in Oakland. And I chose uh, green colors because of Oakland colors are green, basically. Design logos and everything, the like business card, letterheads, all that type. So I'm already working in something with graphic design. I'm satisfied with the process, it was a good, good practice, and I thought it was good, man. Students involved with this program realize that graphic design combines quite a few disciplines. Since I do photography outside of school, I wanted to play on the fact that that's what I do other than graphic design. Judges from educational, creative, and business spheres came out to critique the students' work. This is what education is about. It's a partnership, collaboration to allow for the genius of students. One of the things I enjoy most each year is coming in and seeing the graphic arts uh, department's work. The students are very diverse. The uh, results uh, are very diverse also. It's uh, always an exciting show. A lot of talent here. Uh, it's really interesting to see the students come in raw right at the beginning, but uh, they all progress rapidly. I think that their um, presentation techniques need improvement. That's why we want to develop a, a contact with our communications department to help uh, coach that because in the long run, that's what they need to get jobs and that's what they need to uh, present their designs and their concepts to you know, to a public or to an audience, if they have to sit in front of a board of directors, uh, those are the kinds of things that sell the work. If you can't talk intelligently about your work and what's behind it, uh, good chance is that they'll buy something else besides yours, even if yours is the best design. The goal of the billboard is to have people sort of think of Oakland in a different way, and I feel that giving like a whimsical build really get across that message. Some students noted personal concessions they would have to make in order to fulfill the public job. Maybe somebody like not from Oakland would see it and be like, oh, you know, Oakland's not so bad. But I mean, the people that live here, like, you're still going to realize, like, you know, what's what and stuff like that. Graphic design is a problem solution field. You have to be able to define a problem and solve that problem for the customer. Graphic design is fine arts with handcuffs on. It would appear, though, that no job was beyond these students' creative capabilities. The 2011 Inspire Oakland winners were celebrated on June 2nd. First place went to Nick Eagle, second place to David Flores, third to Jason Suryatomo, and fourth to Travis Henson. Commuters, Commuters driving, driving along, along Highway 80 in Berkeley, in Berkeley California, California will see these works displayed, we'll these on, works the displayed on the digital off billboard the Gilman Street exit. right off the Gilman Street exit. Let's all continue to inspire Oakland, and you can learn more about us at odalc.org or by visiting inspireoakland.com. You come to Laney College, you sign up for graphic art uh, in the A building, A152. You'll find my office, come in here and talk. I'm glad to talk to anybody who's interested in our program.